Well, everyone, this is part three of the Fackler's Appalachian Trail Adventures through the Smoky Mountains. The weather forecast for Gatlinburg area was rain all day, so we decided to take a zero and look at the local sites. While in eastern Tennessee, there's no way I wasn't going to check out some of the local moonshine. The Seaverville Baptist Church runs shuttles twice a day up to Newfound Gap and Clingman's Dome. So we hitched a ride at the Tennessee North Carolina line and started our trek north. Well, look, Lolly, only 1,972 miles to Mount Katahdin. We're almost to Ice Water Spring Shelter. The sun has just come out, but the trail's still like a little mini river. And you can see how it's eroded through here. I'll walk for a little bit. So we're hoping the sun comes out good because Charles Bunyan is about a mile and a half and it's a great overlook. So we're gonna eat some lunch here in a couple minutes and get on our way. Trail's a lot better today than the other day when it was so muddy. It's still wet, but it's not muddy. Well, the trail through here has become the Appalachian Trail River, but nice clean water and it's not real deep, so it's not tough. Well, one of the best parts of the whole Appalachian Trail is Charles Bunyan, and it looks like the clouds are starting to lift a little. Not very much. There's a sign back there that said closely controlled children, so that's probably a pretty good idea. Hi there, how you doing? Uh, we're getting down real soon. Yeah. So you'll get a picture without it. So 41 uh, years later, I'm doing it again. That's awesome. awesome. And I love that you can do it God, with someone that you love. So yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 We've, been married. We've been married 37 years. Great to Good. meet you. I yeah. really yes, have a great oh, time. Oh, yeah. yeah. Just subscribe to my channel, then you'll get the updates. <laughs> I hope that you make it. Well, just left Charles Bunyan. And a little bit of a view today, but not much. But the clouds were swirling, so that was kind of pretty. This is the trail. Again, it's been raining. But this the trail here. It's kind of rocks and sand. So it's not muddy at all versus a couple days ago when it was just so muddy. So this is a pretty easy walking today. Feet are wet, but that's okay. Socks will dry. Well, we've dropped in elevation a little bit, so don't have as much moss. And the big key now is we have rhododendrons and much bigger trees, as you can see, how big that tree is compared to Tammy. But the trail also now is going back to the muddy stuff instead of the sandy and the rocks. So I guess you can't have everything. Good video view here. Good view here today. Okay, finally. Well, good morning everybody after the foggy rainy day yesterday it's bright blue sky as you can see hiking up the trail it's gonna be a short day only 5.4 miles here in the Smokies you have to stay at the shelters so either it was a 5.4 mile day or a 13 plus day and we didn't want to do 13 so we're taking it easy it is April 10th 
and we started March 9th, so that's pretty cool. We're still trucking along. Trail's pretty nice today. We're on a downhill section now. Beautiful blue sky. Say good morning. Good morning. How's everyone this morning? Everybody's doing great. Well, we're back over 6,000 feet today. Today will be our last day over 6,000 feet until we get to Mount Washington in New Hampshire. And the trail is just amazing today. All the moss, it's a nice easy trail to walk, and sunshine. It's days like this, that's why we know why we're out here. After the Smokies, there's a hostel called Standing Bear. We've heard it is really rustic and different. So our next video will be starting there at Standing Bear 